and welcome. Today we're going to look at a Lazy Boy recliner. Lazy Boy has some features built into their chairs that are different than other recliners on the market. We're going to look at one of those features today. It's the back tilt. It's actually a separate action that's not tied into the footrest. With most recliners, when you pull the handle, the footrest comes forward while the back tilts back in unison. But here they're two separate actions. You can use, engage the footrest to elevate your feet while keeping the back totally in the upright position. Or you can leave the footrest down and tilt the back. And if you notice, the seat also moves forward when the back tilts. And Lazy Boy says the reason for that is that they want to avoid this separation between the lower back and the seat when you're in the reclined position. Okay, and as you can imagine, there's some practical uses for these two separate features. What they used to call the TV position, with a Lazy Boy you can easily keep the back upright while you elevate your feet and watch TV, or you can push back slightly and get a very slight recline, or a deeper recline. Since they're separate actions, you can dial them in to suit exactly the comfort level you desire. Now since not everybody has the same body type, Lazy Boy did provide a tension adjustment for the back tilt, and we'll take a look at that next. Okay, to access the tension adjustment, you don't have to take anything apart on the chair. You simply roll it over, as I've done here, and from underneath, you'll see the thumb screws are on each side of the chair at the seat, at the bottom of the seat. Here's a close-up of what they look like. And to add tension, you just want to tighten it just like a screw. You want to turn it clockwise to loosen it counterclockwise. Now it's important to remember, whatever you do to one side of the chair, the adjustment, you should do the same to the other to keep the tension even. It's very important. And as I said earlier, since there are different body types, the tilt-back tension might be perfect for your father or yourself, but when a different family member starts using the chair, it's not going to work perhaps as well, and that's when you may need to make the adjustment. So start in small increments, do like a half a turn at a time, do the same on each side, set the chair up, and try it out until you get it dialed in just right. Okay, so that's it for this video. We'll see you next time.